Sports, where Phillies baseball happens. Sports Radio 94 WIP. All right, welcome back. Sam Donnell in a few minutes on all the controversies we're juggling simultaneously in Philadelphia. But I got to just tell the story. I told it the other show yesterday, but so many people asked me if I had mentioned it. So I want to just retell it quickly here now because I am in the presence of true greatness. And I don't mean you, Al. No. Uh, Anyway, at the very end of the trip, he was not there for this. Uh, A guy in a wheelchair and a top hat (laughs) named Bobby uh, came to me and he said, uh, you are a giver and it's time somebody give you something. And he brought out this huge box. In fact, he wheeled over in the wheelchair, pulled it out of a van, wheeled back, propped it up on a wheelchair, handed it to me. And it was a big Amazon.com box box okay long and narrow and i open it up and in it was a fine looking electric guitar wow that's a good gift and he said you always said you wish you were a guitarist so you could get chicks huh. i was kind of weird that he said it because my wife was standing next to me at the time yeah and but then right away she seemed to warm up to me because as soon as i had the guitar in my hand she warmed up to me yeah. And then I brought it home, and then I didn't know what to do with it because I cannot play a guitar. In fact, I play no musical instrument. Good thing I didn't give you a flute. And yet, <laughs> and yet here I sit well, the- next to a superstar guitarist and one of the top rock entertainers in this city, the legendary Tommy Caldwell. How you doing, Tom? Good morning. And, and Tom, I just, could you be honest with me? Because i got to be honest. My guitar looks better than that thing. You're, you, that looks old. How long you been playing that guitar? Oh, I don't know, 15 years, 20 wow. years or something. And all this wear is for me, too. This thing was mint when I got it. But it was you know, mint? Yeah, but Did you uh, pay I'm a professional. for yours also? I forget. Probably, I don't even remember, man. 1200 maybe. All right, see, Al, it's not that much more. Nah, mm. Al's out of the Tommy, how something. long does it take to become an accomplished guitarist? 20, 30 years, probably. But, Angela, the thing is... <laughs> You don't need to learn how to play it. Just, I'm telling you, just just get a strap, sling it. <laughs> no, sling I it have low. a strap. Yeah, not I that's a, a strap. guitar strap. All right, a guitar no, strap. He gave me a strap. Okay. He even gave me a pick. Okay. So mm. just practice your poses in the mirror. That's the main thing. <laughs> okay, you just want me to pose with the thing. Yeah, just provide. So you don't think I could learn to play a guitar? Definitely not. But you could take a few pictures, <laughs> take a few pictures, promotional pictures, and get a little CD case and right. print them out and put them in there and give them to people. Say, hey, here's my CD. Check it out. They won't listen to it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> wow. All right. Now, here. Now, yesterday I was doing a little riff on how Cole Hamels, to me, was a man. All right, because I heard what he did there, Tommy. That to me, he knew the minute he threw with that kid, they're gonna throw at him. Yeah, to me, care. that's a man. He knew he was gonna hit, get hit with a baseball ninety miles an hour. That's not gutless to me. He's a bad, bad man. He's a bad, bad <laughs> man. And then when the Joe got Conklin heard, he said, "Why don't we get Tommy Conwell to tweak one of his top hits?" And to make it uh, a song about Carl Hamels. Well, you're lucky I was available. <laughs> I understand that, Tom. And believe me, the money that we are offering you for this uh, is in the, it's in the mail. Very generous. Can we? Uh, so tell us exactly what we're going to do here. So, uh, well, I have a song called "I'm Not Your Man" from the '80s, right. and uh, and uh, Joe. Uh, 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 worked up some. Cole Hamels is going to sing it with me. Cole I'm is sing. singing it too. Cole Hamels is here. He's going to sing it with me. I oh, did not boy. know that. Al Cole Hamels is singing it. It's always better when you I know. Mean, hold on a minute. <laughs> Cole, Cole, get over here for the. Hi, Cole. Good morning, Angela. How Hi, are Cole, you? Cole. Thank you for coming by today. <laughs> Tommy Conwell. Hi, hey, Cole. How you doing, man? Hi, Tommy. Hello. How are you? Because he is suspended, but not from radio. Uh, man, you're tall. Cole, you are tall. How tall are you? Don't worry about it. That's a big guitar. Yeah. All right. Okay. So so you guys are going to come together, and you're going to do I'm Not a Man, and you're going to make it into a Excuse Cole Hamill song. I am a man. Right. I am a man. You ready? I'm ready. Seven days a week is just too much for teams to handle. Don't take them off, you'll pick yourself up off the floor. I'm boss now. Look at Cole Hamels, everything about him is trouble. Look at me. He's bad for sure. Damn straight. Yeah, he's a man. Hello. And he's Angelo's new hero. Yeah, Cole is leaning me. I'm really tall, too. Yeah, he's a man. The Phillies gotta hold on to him. What we need So glad the Cole is here A tough guy like no other Do what you gotta do to make 
can want to stay. Though he's been here a while, no reason to be moving. The Phil's gotta pay. Hello. Yeah, he's a man. And he's Angelo's new hero. Welcome to the yeah, big. Cole is leaning me. Show some respect. Yeah, he's a man. He's just a kid. Phil, he's got to hold on to him. I'm old school. Baby Cole is what we need. Not one to clown. He don't play around. How about this punk? You just got plumped. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but a fastball to the buttocks, that'll get your attention. Not the one you want to meet in a back alley. <laughs> Heard that guy Hamels is a bad, bad man. Bad. I'm here. You'll be the one they're picking up and getting carried. Cole's throwing hands. It's not subtle either. Yeah, he's a man. And he's Angelo's new hero. Yeah. Yeah, Cole is leaning me. I'm tall too. Yeah, he's a man. The Phillies got to hold on to him. Baby Cole is what we need oh old school baseball wow that was a really good time Tyler, Tyler is a man he's a farmer young rumba oh, you are sensational <laughs> i watched you play that guitar you've done that before i have you are terror you are absolutely terrific at that ability well, you 20 know. to 30 years you said and so i give lessons too you do yeah come on over seriously <laughs> Two hundred dollars a half hour. <laughs> My goodness. No, seriously, you you do give lessons though? Uh, yeah, sure. Because you can you can play that thing. Uh, You're yeah. what you call an axe man. I've been doing it a while. <laughs> that's a, hey, that's the Angelo, term. that's a new uh, deodorant now. Reading up on it now. It's a deodorant now. I'll teach you. Just ax him. This Saturday night, I'm at the Brownies 23 in Armour with In the Pocket. That's Davey Wasick and from the Hooters, his all-star jam nice. band. Wow. Raising nice. money, raising money for Settlement Music School. And uh, and uh, it's uh, it's me. It's Richard Bush from the A's. It's the guys from the Soul Survivors. It's Jeffrey Gaines. It's an all star wow. jam band. Jeffrey Sat Gaines. Yeah, Jeffrey Love Gaines Jeffrey is there. Gaines. He's awesome. Oh, he's That's a great show. It's really, really, really fun. A bunch of the guys from the Hooters, Robbie Hyman, Dave Wasik, and it's Saturday wow. night at Brownies Twenty Three in Armour. Tremendous stuff. And uh, Tommy, please don't be a stranger. Right? We love your work. You too. Edge. We have never forgotten the year you performed at our Wing Bowl. It's one of the great highlights of our Wing Bowl. We You're rocked right. it. We rocked you it. Ro you kicked the crap out of the Wells Fargo Center. It hasn't fully recovered yet. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy Conwell's a man. I start to talk now a little bit like these guitar yeah. heroes do. TommyConwellStore.com. You can find out more. TommyConwellStore.com. And we're going to get a recording of that, right, uh, Cole? I've, absolutely. All right, go in there. The and studio version Echo? and the live version. I right, like two versions. I like that. We'll put it on like okay. a 45. He's done. And then you're going to strap it on later. I will right, strap mine on later. Yeah, so I'm nice. strapping it. Okay, <laughs> yes, I'm leaving. I'm Tommy, leaving. thank you, my man. Tommy Conwell is a hero with this town, and he always will be. And I'll tell you something else, Al. What? If you wanted to put him on the list of tough guys in Philadelphia, you wouldn't be half wrong. I'd be all right. <laughs> exactly. That's what I meant. <laughs> Let's go to John. Hi, John. Good morning.